Yeah, what's up, everybody? You already know what time it is, bro. Your boy iPod is back in Indy. We got the NBA 2K League Championships this week. Yes, I know you see me smiling. Your boy got the braces. Yes, sir. Listen, look, I know it's a lot that I want to tell you guys about, but first, I need to get dressed. We about to head to the first day of the 2K League. Let's get into it. King Kong. King Kong. King Kong. King Kong. All right, so look, let me tell y'all what happened, right? Now, to explain all this, I got to talk in many different ways. I've never had braces a day in my life until two days ago. So two days ago, I go to my orthodontist, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to my orthodontist. You know what I'm saying? Did great work, by the way. But I went to my orthodontist and I was telling them that, you know, the two teeth next to my my uh, top row, like middle joints, don't move down. And basically he was telling me, yo, they're the most stubborn teeth to move down. You know, you're basically putting a piece of plastic in your mouth and telling bone to move down. And I'm like, Listen, I don't want to get fit for another Invisalign. I'm done. You know what I'm saying? It's been years. He's like, okay, we can go about it this way. How about I put you in some braces for about four weeks? And let's see how that go. I'm like, oh, I don't know, doctor. I don't know, bruh. I don't know if I can do braces. But then I'm just thinking in my head, like, I got to get refitted, right? Then I got to wait another six to eight weeks for the new trays to come in, which means I'm going to be in the same tray that I had in my mouth for two weeks already for another six to eight weeks. That's 10 weeks with the same nasty, dirty, dusty, ruggedy tray in my mouth. So I was like, you know what? F it. Just give me the braces, bro. So he connected the braces to the uh, first uh, top eight of my teeth. And I'm going to just keep it all the way tall with y'all, man. I'm not feeling it at all. I can't take it out of my mouth. I don't know what the hell I was thinking. I got a newfound respect to everybody out there that wear braces or been through the braces journey. I don't like it. Not only is this brace cutting my lip, it's pissing me off. Every time I eat, it's nothing but food and food and juice and food and food and candy and juice. Okay, let me X out the candy. I've been doing a lot better. I'm down I'm down 12 pounds, by the way. Y'all see, see how slender your boy looking? Hold on. Hold on, you know what I'm saying? But look, braces just ain't for me. And no, I would not recommend them to anybody else. Guess who I found in the back of an Uber, bro? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so look, me and Ronchi are on our way to the pavilion right now. We're about to go watch the first couple games of the 2K League. Trey is knocked out in his room. Uh, that boy was recording late last night and was packing, got straight up, came to Indy. So he's going to take a little power nap. We about to check out the Heat versus Knicks game. That shit still be going on. So, you know what I'm saying? Y'all about to see the venue and all that. All right, let's get it. I know that this camera is hella bokeh right now, but I'm going to show you guys. They really be having Indy shut down, bro. Like, they be having the banners and all that, bro. Like, it's, it's really crazy down here in Indy, bro. Like, all 2K League stuff, bro, going on. Look at this, bro. They got the whole side of the building tarped up and all that. It's really about to be a movie. Oh, they got a, hold on. They got a real basketball court over there? Oh, I'm finna get buckets. Hold on. You ain't getting shit. You ain't getting shit. You was a, you was a hater. You know what I'm saying? Your mama told you you was one. Bet you can't hit that shot. Okay. I bet you. How much you want to bet? How much you trying to bet? Friendly dollar. Friendly dollar. Right Two tries. No, one try, nigga. What are you talking about? I said, I bet you can't make it. Not how many times out of how many shots? Make the bucket. Make the bucket. You stink. You stink, and everything about you stink. Your wrist stink. Look at it. It's <laughs> yes, sir. We made it in. We made it in. We made it in. So, look, the Knicks versus the Heat right here, right now. 5v5. Yo, look at the venue, bruh. So this is major, bro. Major, bro. Come on. Come on. Come on. Sheesh. This is jazz, bro. Yo, what y'all know about this, man? Look where game in the took it, bro. Private event. Pack house. They're not under 
major, bro. You already know, man. I'm going for the Knicks, my boy Radiant. Yeah, that's a late. Right now, you see the boys over there. You know what I'm saying? They, they over there labbing right now in a timeout, trying to figure out how they're going to win this game. You know what I'm saying? I'm only going for the Knicks game because of my boy Radiant. Listen, y'all know how I do, bro. Any Sixer, any former Sixer, any Sixer GC that's currently on roster, I'm riding for you, bro. I'm telling you, I will punch on somebody for you, all right? All right. So right now, we are watching the Bucks destroy the Mavs right now. The Lakers just won game one. And Ronchi is trying to figure out what place we're going to eat from for an effing mukbang. He tried to get African food. Trey don't want it because he said African food in Indy is not smart. Then he said Pratillo's. Trey still doesn't want to eat because he doesn't want to eat a cake that has mayo in it. So I honestly don't know what we're going to eat. All I do know is my mouth is killing me, and I just want to go because I'm hungry. My boy. What do you want from me, bro? Stop recording me. My boy. I'm just looking for another bill. What are you I'm talking about? <laughs> bro, go ahead and do your thing. You know what I'm saying? That boy close. Ooh, Damn shit. Sir. Ooh, shit. Ooh, shit. Damn shit. Hey, I, boy, I swear to God, that shit better be in there. <laughs> bro, I'm trying to make boy. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Nigga, just because you took your bag off. What the fuck? God damn. It's a draft thing. God <laughs> Only because it's drafted here. That's a women's ball. You, you didn't care about the women's ball, but I was shooting. What do you mean? You ain't care about that. I didn't know it was. Nah, man. Nah, man. It ain't that damn windy and indie. <laughs> you tripping, nigga. Are you crazy? Do it again. If you do it again, you, you might be something. He said, do it again. Right. Ooh. All right. We uh, ended up leaving a little early. We about to go out to dinner real quick. We was supposed to be shooting a mukbang for Raunchy Channel, but I guess we'll do that uh, tomorrow or some shit. Trey, he about to eat this mayo. <laughs> nah, we about to go. We about to go somewhere called uh, was it Portillos? Perlillos? Portillos. Portillos. Yeah, we about to go eat there. It's going to be a nice little vibe. We're probably going to be riding scooters all night. You know what I'm saying? Chilling in Indy. I got a public service announcement for everybody watching this vlog. Raunchy is now uninvited to the cookout. Raunchy took me to this place earlier today. Um, I don't know how to pronounce it. But all I'm going to say is that is dog shit. Literally, the only thing is missing off this cup is HIT on the end of dogs. It was dog shit. Raunchy made me order something called a number five that had like some beef and a fucking Italian sausage in the middle of that shit with some weird ass peppers on it. I instantly almost threw up. I spit my food in the back. Listen, I'm, I'm one of those people that's discreet when they don't like a certain type of food. Maybe I'll finish it or you know what I mean? Maybe I'll just, you know, hurry up and chew it, swallow it and just guzzle down some water or something like that. I spit that shit in a bag, bro. Not only that, he made me get something called like a Maxwell Polish some shit. Well, you know what I'm saying? Like a big ass piece of kielbasa or some shit with some nasty ass onions on. The worst meal I've ever had in my life. Raunchy is no longer to be trusted with food spots on any trip for the rest of his life. He is excommunicated from all food apps while on vacation do not trust him i repeat if you see raunchy and he say what's the move for the night as far as food run you better be ipod you better be shake run with jay-z and brute or get baked right after the loss your team